Hey guys, it's Mr. Vman858 here, and I am here with Driver San Francisco. Yay, happy music, oh my god, from the 70s. Oh my god, I hope this is not copyright. Let's get in the store real quick. Uh, oh god, what? Hurry up, I don't want to get sued. But yeah, we're here. Um, got my new mic today. I'm using headphones so my microphone is louder because I usually use my external speakers and I've done a whole freaking hour video and uh, <sighs> wasted an hour when I heard my microphone sounded way too quiet. Driver San Francisco. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Driver San Francisco. Blah 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 blah. People probably already know the story and if you don't go buy the game because I bought this game off for of Steam. Alright. It's probably lagging. Oh. It's not lagging for me right now. It's it looks like it's running at twenty something frames per second, which it normally runs at like forty frames. Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah. So uh, didn't do many videos recently. I did uh, Echo Box um, earlier. I think uh, yesterday was it? Or a couple days ago? Yeah, a couple days ago. <laughs> I don't keep track. Um, I did the video. Uh, I did get actual responses of Steve Huff. Like I don't understand why. Um, I I don't know. It's just spirits go crazy when you say Steve Huff on there, and they just say Steve Huff back. But anyway, this is not a paranormal video, and uh, I'm thinking of kind of doing both. Ooh, is that a stadium? What's the thing? It's empty, but um, I'm thinking of doing, you know, both gaming sessions and Echo Box sessions because I've noticed that I've had a lot of, uh, a lot of. See, I can't think now because I've already like said everything in the first video that I made. <laughs> um, I have a lot of paranormal community people in my video or in my uh, channel. Nice car. What? Not that nice. It's a freaking Crown Vic. Ah, oh, there's two people in there. Hold on, let me find a vehicle that doesn't have two people in it. It's really annoying to. Oh, please don't have two people. Please don't have two people. Fucking have two people. Ah, oh, shut up. Oh my god, I have to turn this music off. Turn this music off. Okay. And there's only me. Okay, cool. Um. Alright. <clears throat> so, I got the new microphone. I have a lot of people subscribe to me who are in the paranormal business or likes paranormal things mostly, um, which I can respect that. And of course, I'm still going to make uh, Echo Box sessions, T1 sessions, um, but I also want to throw in some gaming videos in there. Now, recently I've also haven't had the time to, you know, um, make videos or buy games. And do all this and it took me a while to buy this microphone just because I was busy with work and uh, yeah so the main thing is now uh, also my computer is a complete piece of crap that's why it's lagging right now like I'm running this game and I think almost medium settings like half medium half low and right now it's kind of like acting shitty. I don't know how it's gonna get on the video. It's probably gonna lag more on the video because here it's actually looking okay. Now it's kinda like frame ready for some reason. Um, but yeah. Uh, I wanna make more, I don't know, scary videos. I wanna put out more driver content if I can get this fucking game to run a little better while I'm recording. That's why I usually play indie games. Um, I mean, let me tell you the specs of this computer. It's two GBs of RAM. It's a dual core, and it has a really small 140 watt power supply in it with a NVIDIA graphics card unit that is a 9200 9 GE, I think. So everything's really, really low spec on my computer. So I hope you guys understand why I'm playing low res games. Like the resolution's a little bumped down. Hold on. I think that 
have a person in here because it's a fancy car. Okay, new Course. timetable. To oh hell with the time. Let's tear it up. Hell yeah. Um, so you can see I bind it my keys and it's familiar. And I am using a PS3 controller. Um, obviously using DS3 too. I know it's not going to be a very interesting video because I'm not joking around or saying stupid stuff and I haven't made another video since the fact. Oh shit. Oh my god. I never got that much hair. Uh, You'll do it better next time. Oh, okay. Sound like it just came. Uh, <laughs> but it's going to be more interesting videos. Like I said, uh, or I didn't say, but I normally don't care for the views. I don't care how many views I make. I get like two or one views. At least I know that somebody at least watched. I don't really care. You know, as long as I can make people happy. And I'm not saying that like a sellout type deal to fake out, or I'm not saying that get it as a lie. Um, I'm trying to be truthful in here. I have a job, and I work. I make money that way. I don't do this to try and make money. I'm not trying to become big to make money. I'm not even trying to become big in general. If I can have, like, you know, like right now, the subscribers, the amount of subscribers I have, I'm happy. I'm extremely, like, I'm astounded on how many subscribers I got in the recent time, in a recent month. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm really happy with what I have. And I'm not the type of person who's, oh, give me more, I want more subscribers, I want more, you know, views, and I want more. I don't care. I'm not a Ferengi. He's got a call back. <laughs> I'm, it's my little shut boy. Up. Shut up. Shut up. I know. It's your little boy. Shut your face. Shut your face. I kill you. Of course, your car doesn't get damaged. <sighs> but, yeah. So my plans are to continue making videos, I want to continue uh, putting out content, um, you know, I don't care what kind of support I get, if I don't get support at all, I really don't care, I mean, you can call me a piece of shit, or, oh, I hate your voice, or, oh, you're a fucking faggot, or some shit like that, you know, that's fine. Anyway, that's illegal, I think, now. I don't know if there's rules or something, but I'm uh, against that bullying crap. I mean, I haven't got any bad support like that, but I'm just saying, if I do, I really don't care. You can hit me, but it won't hurt, because it's just words. Sticking, uh, sticks and stones. But, um, uh, I'm saying but a lot, because I have to do this a second time. And my second, my first one was actually a lot more... Um, better, because I didn't have to think of what to say. But now, since I have my headphones on, I'm having like sounds going right into my ear. It's kind of like a bitch. Actually, I'm gonna just take my headphones off. How about that? Ugh. Okay. So now my headphones are Hold on. Okay. So yeah, that's better. I don't have to hear crap in my ears, and I can actually concentrate now. I couldn't concentrate because when shit's like directly in my ears, that's why I usually like to play with my speakers. But I've noticed that the way to record properly is to actually have your speakers off and use headphones, so you can have louder feedback from the microphone, which I did not know that. And no, it's not the reason why my old microphone didn't work that well. It's because, um... That thing was a piece of shit from the 90s. It's really old for Microsoft. Yeah, I tried to bus. I bonda. No, I have drove. I have drove it. <laughs> drove it. I have driven it. Ah. But um, <clears throat> my voice is a little tense right now. I don't know what's going on, but my throat hurts. I normally don't talk this much. So, I still have to get used to talking a lot. Um, get that nice car over here. Nice um, uh, I'm just, I keep going, um, because I'm like trying to think of what to say. I'm just like letting my brain kind of go into think mode. I'm not going to go in that mode because I usually make voices like the Russian voice. 
for example, for Indian, oh hold on, that's <laughs> something for it. Hello, welcome to 7-Eleven, I know this is racist in a way, but I don't care what you think. I, uh, if you probably click on the link above my channel, you might have seen a bit, or not a video, but a, a recording of the scammer. That was me, I know you probably know that by now, but I just wanted to make sure that you knew that this was me at the whole time talking to myself asking myself to spell out dumbass or was it was it dumbass no it was something else what is a spell out i don't know i forgot i it's, I, I i've only listened to it once okay maybe five seven twenty times okay don't question my logic i've listened to it twenty times all right because it was very entertaining to me too. and i don't know if anybody ever clicked there is no likes that is there so of course there is no type of feedback, I don't know. You could probably comment, I think you could comment on there. But, uh, anyway, uh, I don't know, I should not do this whole video in the action of the end. Oh shit. Oh shit! Yes! Oh. Yeah, this is how I like to do it. All the time, my Paji told me. That. Oh shit, why is not why not moving? Car go! But my Paji told me that when I drive like a madman, he will take my colors. I don't know what kind of. I do have Indian friends, so it's not racist. I have Indian friends. Actually, my best friend is in Heartbreak. I don't know if he's ever seen. I don't know if he even knows about my channel actually. Because I never really told anybody about my channel. Yeah, care about support. Uh, but yeah. Um, yeah, gaming videos. It's a, it's a really hard field, actually. It's really competitive. Like, you have PewDiePie. I don't like PewDiePie anymore. I used to watch him way back when he started, when he was at least normal. Now he's just completely, I don't know what to call I don't want to offend anybody or, you know, say anything offensive, but it's just, he's really got a point to me, he's very repulsive. You know, a bunch of gay jokes and shit, um, you know, I kind of put aside for a while, but it just kind of got to me to the point where I just, you know, that's it. And I unsubscribed, and I couldn't watch it anymore. I know that a lot of people support him, and that's awesome. I don't know... I've always been a little suspicious though. To be honest, I've always been a little suspicious about the amount of subscribers he's had. And a correlation to the views, it kind of had me thinking that something is wrong here. How do you have those many subscribers and not even the majority of views that you should be getting if you have those many subscribers. I mean, are you telling me that 30 something million people subscribed and then don't watch? Like, is that the deal here? Or is just YouTube not putting up the view counts? I mean, do they have a cap on that? I don't know. But it just, it really kind of is very suspicious. I don't know if YouTube is investigating or I doubt it. I mean, it's probably like so powerful, YouTube can't even investigate. I don't know how it works. Um, you know, I'm just talking out of my ass. But it's just what I think. It's my opinion. Mm -hmm. um, I've actually noticed that the internet kind of changed. Because I've actually put out my opinion a few times for a few things. And people weren't too negative about it anymore. Like I remember a few years ago when people would just bomb on you. He <laughs> said something about somebody. Um, they would just go fucking nuts. Now I guess the internet finally matured, I would say. It, it matured, um, you know, since um, I turned 18, I've also matured. I remember when I was younger and I would say stupid shit and I would, you know, defend PewDiePie and I would defend all kinds of YouTubers. Now it's just, I really don't give a fuck. 
about anybody. Like, I don't care. I'm not very, I'm not a fanboy anymore like I used to be. I used to be a loyal fanboy back in the day. You say that like an old grandpa or something. Oh, I, I didn't tell you, um, YouTube doesn't know this, but now you will know, I've always wanted to be a cop, so I'm thinking that I'm going to try and get into law enforcement, which is probably going to take out most of my time from making videos or anything, um, and, you know, I wish myself luck, um, I, I guess no one's ever said that, but I do wish myself luck, I'm hoping that I can become a police officer. So it's been my dream and my passion since I was five years old. And I'm getting a little too personal in this video for some reason. I guess because I ran out of shit to talk about. Because I did such a good commentary on the first video that I made, but it just you, that was barely heard due to the fact that the video was so uh, the sounds were so loud from the game. And it, the microphone was picking up on everything on my voice and the sound from the game when. The recording device is supposed to pick up on everything. I normally am used to this <laughs> because I watch a lot of uh, police videos. So I'm used to this view. Yeah, I'm the cop. Yeah, police, bitch. I can drive better in this view, too. Um, only in a police car for some reason. It's because I've watched so many police videos, I know how cops drive <laughs> from this angle. Yeah, it's kind of um, So yeah, I'm, a, I'm gonna do both contents. I'm back, you know, I have to get back on the point for a short amount of time before I get this video up to like two or three hours. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to do um, both Echo Box T1 and gaming videos. Because um, again, like I said, I do have a few people from the. Uh, gaming community and I have a few people, actually more people, from the uh, supernatural community. And I respect both sides. And you know, I'm not gonna stop and just be like, you know what, I'm just gonna do gaming videos and that's that. No, I'm gonna do both. Because, you know, I wanna keep everybody happy. And when everybody's happy, I'm happy. You know, um, I'm not satisfied until Every person is satisfied. It's just my thing. I don't know. I just like making people satisfied, I guess. Um, what else? I'm trying to think of shit to talk about. So if I stutter or if I go um a lot, it's because I'm thinking of what to say. Um. <laughs> exactly my point. But... Um, if you're wondering what I'm using to record my videos, I bought Bandicam, I bought a license. So I use Bandicam to record all my videos. I mean, it works really well, honestly. Ooh, was that a, yeah, that was a back, uh, back into the future, bro. That wasn't pleasant. <laughs> my my voice is like getting really kind of crappy right now because ah, I'm getting so like I'm getting dry throat right now. I need to pull over my vehicle. Uh, I also have uh, SWAT 4. I might do some videos on that if I can get it to run nicely. I'm probably gonna have to put it in mobile because I run that game in high everything and my computer can run it just fine when I'm not recording. But when I'm recording, uh, everything runs kind of like shit. And right now, I don't know how the video is going to come out, because it might come out like shit, due to the fact- oh shit. Sorry about that. <laughs> Let me just have a quick sip of my Coca-Cola. I mean, I don't know if I get in trouble for saying Coca-Cola. And is my radio on? We got the same eyes when we're okay, it was off all the time. Okay, good. Because I don't want to get like copyright issues here. Ah, uh, uh, so nice. It's so nice to have the cocaine in a bottle. 
it's how I like it. Oh, I was wondering um, if I should make a prank video. Now, I buy this energy drink from the grocery market, like from anywhere actually, from Albertsons or from Safeway. And um, it's called Balls. Balls energy drink, and it comes in a bottle. Um, in my state, it comes in like glass bottles. I've seen like, I think, one or two pranks with it. Um, yeah, I've seen like one or two pranks with um, that brand, and people would say, oh, want to touch my balls? But I would say, um, do you want to see my balls? <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of a stupid prank, kind of immature, but uh, I can get pretty immature when I'm doing pranks, trust me. I'm not always serious like this, like when I'm doing gaming videos, I'm not serious like this, like I'd be like, God damn it Charlie, let's go get them motherfuckers, they're running away, and yes I do cuss a lot, so excuse me if you do not like vulgar language, you can let me know that and I will cut down on the language when I'm doing gaming videos. Um, Echo Box Sessions, I am 100% serious like now. Um, But I do not act stupid, you know, immature when I'm doing Echo Box sessions. I'm 100% serious, and I always try to get the best feedback out of the Echo Box. Like recently, the video that I made uh, with Steve Huff, or I didn't do it with Steve Huff, but I got responses. Oh shit! I got responses. I got responses saying Steve Huff's name, and um, they said Steve Huff. They said Steve, and then they said Steve Huff. Really quickly, if you listen with headphones, you will hear. Like I've listened to it over and over and over just to make sure that it said what I think it said, and it said what I thought it said. It was really cool. I, in this game, when I drive a cop car, I always try to drive like a real cop. So that's my thing. Uh, I try to pit maneuver. I don't try to just ram. I try to drive normal. It is a little laggy because I'm recording and there's a bunch of shit going everywhere now. <laughs> Thank God. I, like, I wish they kind of worked on the AI in this game because the AI is shit. Like, complete shit. And I wish, like, the game would have been different. Where you don't just ram the shit out of cars and do all this shit. I wish it would be a little more accurate to real life, but you know, I can't do Because this is all like figuring out things in animation. And look what they're doing, just wrecking the whole city. I didn't even hit a single thing. Well, since I started this chase. But, um, uh, you know, I'm planning to do more videos like this. Um, I'm probably gonna play a lot of indie games, and, you know, normally, with indie games, they're very, it doesn't require high-spec computers, like, my computer, for example, is super low-spec, like I've said, and it wouldn't require me to waste a bunch of RAM, so I'll be able to record, and it will run okay, like, for example, Dungeon Nightmares, which scared the shit out of me at the beginning, but, you saw how I kind of got used to the game after a while, and I stopped getting scared. So I'm, I'm thinking of playing, you know, maybe some horror games, um, <coughs> first-person shooters, um, you know, and if I could get recommendations for games, it has to be a low-spec game. So, I mean, if you're still listening, thank you very much for still listening, because that would be very nice if you are. Um, yeah, I recommend low spec games. Just think that my computer's a piece of shit. I can't afford right now a new one or um, the parts for it because uh, I pay bills and all that crap and you know how things are. If you are living the life of the bill world, I'm gonna get ahead of this guy. Holy oh, shit, what are you doing, dude? I just killed somebody. 
I would get fired from my job. And I kill someone else. Huh. But yeah. I would make a good car. If I just don't run people over like that. It feels like in this game, your car is on ice most of the time. I'm not chasing on anymore. Alright, well, I'm probably gonna end this video. Just because I really ran out of stuff to say. It's not a very eventful video. I mean, you get to see a little bit of gameplay. It's probably gonna lag in the video. I don't know why the video is lagging. Like, right now, for me, um, it's still a playable frame rate. But for some reason, on after I recorded everything, it looks as if um, the video is lagging. Like, literally just kind of like, you know, that annoying lag. But it's not doing that here. Right here, it's just kind of like low frame rate. But not super low where it's noticeable that much. You know, just a tad of... Right now I'm recording at 720p. And 1280 by 720. And it's running at a max 30 frames. And that's the cap for it. So hopefully, you know, it picks up everything okay. Uh, I'm going to make better videos than this one because this one's kind of like just a recap of everything just kind of like what's going to happen in the future of this channel um what's going to become this channel it's going to be a gaming slash paranormal channel that's what it's going to be and uh i don't tell too many people but you know why not disclose this with youtube um the reason why I do paranormal videos is because I've had an experience when I was a little overweight. I think I was like 8 or 9 years old. I might have been 10. Um, so yeah, it's got a little bit of a wide range there. But I remember when I lived in this house and I've lived there like, you know, for since I was born. And, uh,. After the majority of time I've lived there, I've had one experience. I've always been afraid of the hallway because there was this weird, there was this hallway we had, and I've always ran through it, like because I was always, I felt like there was something there. And one night, because I, I used to be really afraid of sleeping in my room for some reason, and it's really understandable for a kid, but it was weird because the fact that what happened when I was in the living room. So in the hallway there's also the pantry. There's a pantry door. Um, and what else? There's my bedroom. Um, so the pantry door is on the left side of the hallway. And so is my bedroom door. And then at the end of the hallway on the left is going to be both my parents' room and or the bathroom. I mean, it was a small house, a really small house. And one night, I was just sitting watching TV in the living room when I hear footsteps. No one was home because um, since then my mom collapsed um, like a year before. She had a stroke and she's like, half of her body is paralyzed. And it's still now today, she lives in a nursing home. So, uh, since then, you know, I've been kind of a loner, <laughs> I guess. Because I was, like, the only child who grew up. I'm not the only child, because, you know, I have my half-sisters and my half-brother. And because we don't have the same dad, you know, so it's, like, half-siblings. Um, but anyway, I don't know why I'm disclosing all that shit with you two. <laughs> Getting a little personal, you know. But, I heard footsteps coming down, um, I, like we had bare floors, so we didn't have carpet, because of course the hallway connected to the kitchen, and then you know, it goes all the way to the bathroom, and uh, I think it was like vinyl floors too, you know, it's old fashioned shit. So, I hear footsteps coming down towards the living room. 
Man, it's just walking. It's like, it's all the way from the bathroom, and it walks all the way to the end to the pantry door. The pantry door. And then it stops right at the pantry. And I look over, and I don't see anything. Nothing at all. I don't see a single damn thing there. And I was so afraid, because, you know, I was young, I was a kid, I was like, what the fuck? Am I imagining this? And I was thinking I was dreaming. Um, but no, it was all real. I could have slipped the whole night up. But that's not all. So, after it stopped, it started knocking on the pantry door. And it just kept knocking. And then I just covered my uh, head with uh, the blanket and plugged my ears for like a minute and then when I took my hands away from my ears um, I couldn't hear anything anymore and I looked over and I was so afraid I was so so afraid I couldn't sleep the whole night and after that I don't remember anything but that's something that will stick with me forever and that's how I know there are entities and spirits and after we moved out, I did find out that our landlord's mother died in that house. And it might have been her trying to communicate. I don't know. I always wanted to go back to that house and explore, you know. Because she knows me. I mean, like, obviously, she, I, if I tell, if I say, you know, who I am, you know, I was raised there in that house, and I'm that kid. I was scared of you. you know, it'd be pretty amazing. I don't know her name. I never learned her name. Uh, we, my parents just told me that I was uh, her mother. Oh shit! I was in control of her. Oh god! I murdered somebody. Almost murdered somebody. But <sighs> well, that's over. Um, when I've discovered about Echo Box, I've always wanted to be able to use. Oh, wow, look at that. It's a real company, Bose. What the hell? Whoa. Lamborghini. L L Lambo. Yeah, buddy. I never drove this Lambo, too. Um. Whoa, asshole, watch out. It's a freaking expensive ass car. You have to be your whole lifetime. Don't know what else to talk about now. I've ran out of things to talk about. I really did. Like, four shows in it. And I just crashed in a Sierra. Oh! I've always wanted to buy a Sierra. I don't know why, but I've always wanted a GMC Sierra. And, I don't know, I've always loved that truck. I always thought it was awesome. Alright guys, well, thanks for watching. If you've watched to this point, you are a god. Okay, I'm not going to say that because I am a little bit of religious, so you are awesome. Anyway, thank you for watching again. Uh, uh, my back hurts so much right now because the way I was sitting in my chair and I had to like kind of get close to the microphone. I'd say I was a little painful. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed my um, thrilling stories with the ghost experiences. And, uh, you know, hope you like my new microphone if you like the quality of it, because I sure do. Uh, I didn't really talk about very interesting things, and I know this is probably a video that is going to be looked over and skipped over very quickly. But if there is somebody who is a trooper and stuck by and actually listened to the whole thing, I thank you. And if you did listen to the whole thing, maybe you could leave a like. Not saying that you should or I have to, I'm just saying that to let me know if you actually sat by the whole video. But yeah, this is what my channel is going to be. And, you know, it's actually pretty unique if you think about it. There's not too many channels that are committed to gaming videos and also to making paranormal videos that's kind of a new thing I guess on YouTube I don't know but anyway um, you guys have a good one thanks for watching and 
Oh wait, hold on. Let me let my character say goodbye to you too. Mr. I, I do not have a very good name for him, so I'm gonna call him after the vodka Smirnov. And I will have to say goodbye to you. And goodbye my friends, and come to 7-Eleven when you would like to. I give free Twinkies to the fatties, and I give free Slurpees to the uglies. Haha, <laughs> and for the pretty ladies, I give free hot dog. My hot dog, yes, oh ho ho! <laughs> And, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, wait, hold on. <coughs> My voice is really fucked up right now. <laughs> oh, God. I didn't think I was gonna lose my voice <sighs> at the end of this video. And I have to say goodbye to you, too, because I gotta go back to the south and fuck a pig. Like, literally, I gotta go fuck a farm pig. I like fucking them. Oh, yeah. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. My voice is so tired, I have to go and rest it on a pillow. I will have to take out my voice box and put it on a pillow and let it rest. <coughs>